Hello, my name is Alexander Postalian. I'm an interventional cardiologist here at the Texas Heart Institute in Houston, Texas. And welcome to Asked and Answered, where we try to answer uh, patient questions that are common and some that are not so common. And uh, hopefully we can make sense of uh, some problems that some folks are having. So question number one. I used to get a stress test every year, but my new doctor doesn't want to order it. We get that relatively often. What's going on? Well, um, first of all, what is a stress test? Uh, a stress test is a way for your doctor, usually a cardiologist, to assess if there are blockages in the arteries that feed your heart muscle. Um, and to actually get to that diagnosis, we have to simulate a situation of stress, which can be being on a treadmill, being on a bike, or sometimes with a medication injection. In the past, we used to do those regularly, even if a patient felt okay. Right now, we're moving a little bit away from that and doing, doing it only in patients that are at high risk of issues or if they have symptoms like chest pain or shortness of breath. Um, so even though your doctor did it every year, you may not need it done every year going forward. Well, this has been great. This has been a pleasure to be here. You know, I, I love doing this. So please send any questions. It can be anything cardiology related, high blood pressure, diet, medications, testing, valve issues, pacemaker issues, heart failure issues, uh, exercise, you know, questions about limitation or what can you do, et cetera. Um, just send it all. We'll be happy to look it over. Maybe they'll feature in our next uh, session here. And again, this is a general discussion. So if you have any symptoms like chest pain, shortness of breath, it's always good to talk to your doctor. And remember that every patient is an individual. So while we can make general recommendations, in the end, we always make an individual recommendation for a specific patient. So when you're watching something, asking a question, just keep, keep that in mind. We're giving you a general recommendation, but if you want a specific one, talk to your doctor.